Okay, so I'm in a Skype group on Skype, Duh. and um, I was in the group just chatting as normal, and one of my friends on the Skype chat actually said that someone has been stealing emergency alert system videos. Now, this person who was actually stealing the YouTube videos actually bothered to, well, they actually didn't bother to actually uh, put credit back to the owner which, under YouTube's copyright laws, is stealing. In fact, it's under the DCMA laws uh, saying if you don't, you know, if you don't cite your sources, you are basically, you know, you're basically stealing, you know, plagiarizing. You're basically stealing from other people uh, f for your own views. Now, I've seen this happen in the past, and it has happened to me many times. Someone stole my video, uploaded it to their channel for their views, even though I did ask them to take it down politely, and they didn't take it down, so I had to flag, you know, I had to put a copyright uh, s submission in, which was just a DCMA notice, you know, a takedown notice, a DCMA notice. And um, YouTube got back to me saying that they they took down the video and that person was given a copyright strike. Thank God. But uh, this person who I was alerted to by a friend in my Skype group actually said that um, he's been stealing emergency alert system videos and uh, yeah, this person that stole the YouTube video uh, that was stealing these videos actually got caught. Yeah. Uh, one of my friends actually told their subscribers, sorry, one of their subscriber, subscribers in their subscriber database, saying that, um, hey, you, your video got stolen by this guy on YouTube. I'm not, I'm, I'm not going to say any names, but yeah, uh, this YouTube video got stolen by this person on YouTube. And then the subscriber said, oh, okay, I'll, uh, I'll have a look at that. So then. Uh, I hop on to the video the next day, the video the person uploaded, and it said it was unavailable due to a copyright strike. So... <laughs> uh, this person who actually uh, stole the video got karma back to him. Uh, I'm not, you know, I don't want to sound like Derek Savage or anything like that, but uh, this person actually got karma back to him for stealing videos. Now, stealing videos is a thing on YouTube that people do to get views for their own channel and subscribers. Now, I was contacted by this person's, uh, I don't know, I, I have no idea who it was, but I was contacted by uh, this person's guardian parent, whatever, saying that I'm a bully and nobody should watch my videos. Well... All that I was trying to do was trying to point out that your son stole somebody else's video from their channel and uploaded it to their channel. Now, I this this doesn't seem fair. How YouTube can just go ahead and, you know, let people upload any video that they want onto YouTube without uh sending it through a processing filter first. Myself, since I'm partnered, um, I have to get my partner involved if if any of my videos get stolen, which they have in the past, but I wasn't partnered then. Uh, but uh, only recently there have been people stealing videos, uploading it to their channel for their view purposes, and yeah, shit has gone down. Um, so, yeah. That guy got karma. And so, yeah. So, that's about it. Cheers for watching, guys. Uh, this is a game worth more signing out. Don't forget to visit some of my friends' channels. Uh, links are in description. And don't forget to uh, subscribe and ring that bell icon. Because YouTube now wants you to double verify that you want to get subscription notices from me. Cheers for watching, guys, and the game with more signing out. I'm going to leave you with the last few seconds of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Cheers, guys.